about 2018, I was diagnosed with bladder cancer. They told me it was um, a very high, vigorous one. David, you've been located by the Holy Spirit. Just put your vest down for now. <laughs> That's the power of God going through you, David. It's the power of God going through you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We loose you. Do as you're told. Come out of him. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. That's the Lord healing you, David. It's the Lord healing you. It's the Lord healing you. It's the power of God flowing through you. It's the Lord healing you. What do you feel happening, David? Do you feel anything happen? Uh, just a lot of heat in my brain, really. <laughs> it's a strange place. <laughs> Praise God. Go and have a, your scan or whatever. I believe you're okay. I think it was about 2018. I was diagnosed with bladder cancer. I had uh, two operations because it's very, uh, they told me it was um, a very high vigorous one, 2.5, maximum is three. And they said- Three what? Uh, well, three out of three. It's, it goes from one to three cancers. And, um, but about that time, I think it was in the autumn, Mark was coming for the second time to um, do a round in the UK and he stayed with us. And I said, well, if you're coming to stay with us, I'll make you earn your keep and you can run a, a session in our village. Do you remember that? <laughs> but on that night, I was just the organiser and, um, and I was busy trying to get some ventilation. Suddenly Mark appeared around the corner and he goes, oh, it's you, David. Holy Spirit's, um, what's the term? Located. located you. Well, I thought, well, I've, I've never actually been located, I don't think, before. <laughs> so uh, I was as surprised as Mark. And uh, the next thing I remember being on the floor, looking up, and uh, Mark comes over and he says, what are you feeling, David? Now, my memory says I couldn't remember anything, but Neil, my son, when I was telling him today, he said, you told me my head was getting hot. Yes. So anyhow, after a while, I thought, well, I'll get up. I've got to organize things. And when I got up, there was about a dozen people all around me. And my son said, oh, you were actually out for half an hour or so. I thought I just went down and got up. But I remember Mark saying, I think you're healed. Go and get a scan, brother. That's the Lord healing you, David. It's the Lord healing you. It's the Lord healing you. It's the power of God flowing through you. It's the Lord healing you. What do you feel happening, David? Do you feel anything happen? Uh, just a lot of heat in my brain, really. <laughs> it's a strange place. <laughs> Praise God. Go and have a, a scan or whatever. I believe you're okay. <laughs> I don't think you realise in the UK you can't just go to your GP and ask for a scan because you've been healed. <laughs> I can't even get to see your GP these days. But anyhow, as part of my ongoing treatment, they had scans to see how you're doing. And everyone was clear. Uh, and that's been a few years ago. <clears throat> and uh, Who healed you, David? Jesus. Who heals cancer? Jesus. So, praise God, this prostate, this... Um, bladder has been good, so praise God. Someone say hallelujah. hallelujah.